Good morning folks from Capitol Hill, Monrovia, specifically at the main campus of the State Run University. If this is Kun TV and I'm Sylvester Chiropli. Members and militants of the Student Unification Party are the type of students who have come to uh, take their exams um, putting on the reason that um, they don't want uh, to see the vice president for students affairs Mr. Seku Kone uh, because they are alleging that uh, the vice president for student affairs is criminal and they don't need him on the premises of the University of Liberia so for this reason you have a uh, Members of the Student Vacation Party scattering the entire campus, uh, disturbing um, students who have come to uh, take their exam. So, folks, this is Poon. I'm Sylvester Chiropli, as you can see all over here. Um, students are leaving their classes, leaving their exam halls, getting out for this reason. All right. Uh, Spoon TV, we keep you posted right here at the uh, State Run University of Liberia, the main campus. All right, so um, the soup many times are touring the entire university, passing them around and making sure that uh, instructors do not go in class for the exams and even the students themselves can leave classes. All right, so uh, that's it as you. You, you watch it, we will also uh, take you around and any moment from now we'll be talking to students um, to know uh, how it is actually affecting uh, them as they should be taking the exams here. Alright? So the question is, why we are um, what actually is the reason or which they want the vice students, the vice pres president for student affairs out of the University of Liberia? The reason that the president of the Republic of Liberia, His Excellency President Joseph Numan Buaka, resolved all of these issues, political issues within the State University by appointing um, an acting president so that uh, the university can have smooth. A process of academic activities but yet still uh, students continue to uh, disturb the campus all right so we will uh, take you around and see the cla the classes are entered students are expected to actually begin their exams unfortunately uh, many times of stu uh, members of the student education party uh, disturbing their colleagues of taking their exams. So here we are. Uh, we will bring you exactly um, what is unfolding right here. Okay. So in a Jeffrey, we will get out there and it will be some of the students who have come to do their exams, but unfortunately uh, they are being asked out of the premises of the University of Liberia. So you see the classes are empty. The classes are empty. The students are walking out uh, due to the ongoing uh, protest by members of the uh, Students' Unification Party. All right, so that's it. So the entire, the entire uh, campus, huh? So uh, I can tell you, please, on this issue, I, tr I try to get out there, but uh, those guys stayed around. All right, they soup many tent, and they are stayed around. Uh, can you come cover me? You came to you came to take that way. I'm ready to go. I let you go there, Yeah. So just let come there. Let me talk to you. 
Yeah, right. So, folks, that uh, get out. Uh, <laughs> no, this, 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 this university is actually uh, it's full of surprises. You see, students are now leaving. You know, <laughs> students are leaving the campus. But let me try to get you know uh, views from a few of the students who are leaving. As you can see, way over there, most of them are the are the me gets now. Leave it. So I try to talk to a few of the students who, who are already on their way. We try to talk to a few students around here. Uh, talk to a few students around here to know exactly where it's afforded right here. Alright. Hello guys. How are you doing? Hello? Can I talk to uh, any of you? This is Poon. I'm Sylvester Chiropley. You understand that students are getting out of the classes due to ongoing protests by a many of the... So far as you can see there, so as you can see, the second corner must leave the University of Liberia. Many times, uh, members of the Student Vacation Party, they are hungry. But I want to talk to a few of the students uh, who have left their classes, exam halls, and to tell you exactly how they feel. Yes. So let me talk to you this further. Welcome to Spoon TV. This is Sylvester Chiropley. Um, what's going on? Here at the main campus of the State Human University of Liberia. Well, I said before you, my is You to be a bitch? I said, standing before you, my is Yeah, we are here this morning to start our panel. These are final exams? Yes. Okay, you were to start your final exam today? Yes. This morning, particularly. And what happened? So, unfortunately, we are on the campus. So many desired it's for the whole stop. Mm. So after studying now, the whole campus is all sat down. Yeah, so I don't even think while I was starting the final three. I did this our feature. So we don't know. What's what it's going Any idea about their plight uh, as as they pass right here, they are saying that uh, they don't want the vast president for Student Affairs, Mr. Seku Kone. What do you know about that? You know that issue. No, not really to my knowledge. Okay. All right. How are these guys' action affected you? Really, went out to where I'm staying and I was in Kowai. Town is full. Why is your call to them? They are your colleagues. They are my colleagues. Okay. If we read our funnel, and then they want to take any other step, we will not be bad. Okay, thank you. Your name again? My name is Mugabe Kamal. Okay, thank you. So folks, that's it. We are still here at the uh, State Roman University of Liberia. So, soup, 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 many things. But let me talk to maybe... Uh, one of these girls here. Uh, welcome to Spoon TV. Uh, I see you. Uh, like you are worrying now. Uh, I know you, but now you should be taking your exam. Unfortunately, you are out of your class. Tell us your name. Uh, what's going on exactly? So, my name is Pastor Tisman. Okay. What are you reading here, by the way? Um, reading public administration. Public administration. Tell us about today's uh, happiness. Mm -hmm. You want to look look at the viewers, please. This is cool. Okay. To, to my exam, unfortunately, there's so much right now. So I don't know. So they ask us to look at us. Yes. So let let this this four parts as you can see. Um. Still passing around and racing the battle girl. What have you? But I get to I got back to this young lady. 
How do you feel? Um, I can't say you abandoned your exams, right? But you were forcefully, you know, taken out of class during your exam. What does this mean? Have you heard that? To be honest, this is not the first time. It only happens because of this our semester is really, really long. Okay, for us as the young folks, we have a mind to learn and to test back in life. It seems that we're set back. Set back. I think I would, I, would, I would love to agree with you that it could be a setback. But what, how do you think uh, these things can be prevented? All of the time when you are taking your exam, then all of a sudden you will see a group of students will take people out and then time is going like you practice it. Yeah, so I recommend that the administration just stand up. You see, all of this is happening because those people are students on the campus. Mm. So, and they don't have the authority in the administration. The administration have authority over them. So they come up and stop all of these things and believe that they will stop them. Wow. Okay. Is there another thing you wish to tell maybe the administration or the government? No, no, no. But to be honest, uh, such but think on this campus, like what we experience as students, is seriously bad and is getting a bit of education, especially on the university campus. Okay. Like my momentum must you have a car learn on your campus. Is that is that <laughs> Okay. Anyway, thank you. It's sad, you know, sad like you said, sad because it it could be a setback or ill, it is a setback. Thank you so much. Your name again? Esther. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. So Esther Smith there uh, speaking to us. So we are still here at the uh, State Run University of Liberia. We try to get at the entrance, you know, to see uh, how students are uh, leaving uh, from the uh, the premises of the State Run University of Liberia. So. Like uh, Esther Smith just said, um, all of these things are setbacks to students who have the, the passion to learn, students who have the desire to, to, I mean, to speed it up and leave the university. For example, if a student has um, a, a desire to spend an like, exact four years at the University of Liberia, four years at the University of Liberia doing a bachelor program, right? And uh, these things continue to happen. Um, it brings setback, like she, she rightly said. It brings setback. So instead of you spending four years, you might like to spend uh, five years or six years. Not necessarily because you draw, but the, because of the disturbance. You know, so as you can see here, um, you see students are here at the entrance of the University of Liberia and the presence of the Liberia National Police is being felt here, all right? The university is, is actually uh, just opposite the Capitol Hill. So way over there you see um, um, officers of the Liberia National Police who are here posted just in case of any other thing, so they could make an intervention, all right? So you see most of the students are just around the, the, the officers of the Liberia National Police, perhaps for, for prevention and uh, any other thing as well, all right? So you see here, this is the main entrance. Uh, these states when University of Liberia. You see students are outside of the University Library of Premises. Some of them try to uh, fire, uh, get vehicles to make their way home. Some of them still observe you uh, to know that maybe uh, the tension could reduce and go back to class and take their exams. You know, that's what they are actually doing here, right? So we we are here, folks. We still remain posted school TV with me, Sylvester. Um, we'll get out there. We'll get in there again to. Um, to, to, to speak to a uh, few of the students, all right? But I would love to, you know, talk to, you know, um, no, no, yes, a few, so. yes, come here, a few uh, students. So I can talk to you, one of the student leaders will quickly talk to, but maybe you can talk to, you know, hi, 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 how you doing, Mona? how you doing? Welcome to Spoon TV. 
I see you going out of the premise of the University of Liberia. Uh, will you mind telling us your name and uh, what they issued this morning on the campus? But you have to take an exam today. Yes. Well, so children is kind of like this. My instructor asked us to bring a wrap and to pass it on the sister and then we can come back. Wow. Meanwhile, we don't want to be in before they hear us. So you will just be around? Yeah, we will just be around. It's going to be Thinking that maybe the tension will reduce yeah. and later on. Maybe our team will speak to them or any higher authority will speak to them. But how do you feel uh, when you already prepared for your exams, you know, and all of a sudden you are being taken out of classes, you know, forcefully? What does that mean? Okay. Is there a message to the administration or even the government? Thank you so much for talking to Spoon. Thank you so much. All right. So uh, that's uh, one of the uh, students here at the state to run your bus and leave it out. But let me talk to this uh, gentleman. He's one of the student leaders here at the uh, yes, the uh, at the state the state run university. So I uh, welcome. Uh, uh, you don't do yourself to the public, please. Yeah, thank you. Um, 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 so we would love to maybe talk to any of them uh, to see where we could get a chance. Uh, can you guys? So you can see there, uh, it is very difficult to have them. But we have to go back and talk to this fellow who we are talking to. Uh, yes. So just we need to do yourself, please, again. Thank you. Um, Will be Sandro Jr. Mm -hmm. and student representative for the UR Council. Yeah, okay. Did you, did you say uh, yeah. student representative for the UR Council? Okay, uh, okay, to the UL Council. Yeah. I, I just I just heard like the US. <laughs> no, no, UL Council. Okay, so what's the issue this morning here at the main campus of University Library? And so this, they has taken me by surprise. Mm -hmm. That's why it has been rumor surrounding the the classes were being disrupted, and today, today we are here, and we see the actual happenings and classes are being disrupted. So, from my understanding, this saga has to do with an inner fight of the political party. Okay. Yeah, as a student leader, I'm convinced of the fight. And why is that political party? Political fight is that the student unification party has. Disagreement, what about disagreement in terms of the leadership structure? Mm. And that is normal in the confines of the politics and the environment. So, so uh, yeah, so we talk yeah, to you uh, uh, for the, the food. Uh, so, let, let's, let, let's try to meet uh, uh, these uh, student leaders to know exactly their plots. What is it exactly? Uh, are they removing students uh, from classes? So, we understand they have that, that, that statement. You know, to be made, uh, so let's listen to them. Why, what's the issue? No, no, no. What's the issue? So, I'm going to ask the party. South! In the first of the year, Capitol Hill, I'm going to go to the BUA. Press statement by immediate release. Supports on Kwaka Kun led government. To lead with transparency and accountability. Supports on the Sekou Kone. To relinquish the Office of Student Affairs. And also welcomes the interim president, Dr. Professor uh, Sakonte. Mando, where to? What was the French? Brothers and sisters of peasantry. The peasant military in the struggle for the advancement of our people's material conditions. Star the compatriots of the home front, ideal lords and cadres. We extend you ultra revolutionary greetings from the Southern Dior and the Zenith. Of Africa, odious, progressive, and power Africanist university campus based students' movement 
The phone goes to the invitation party. So, when Mr. Joseph Human Boyka launched his presidential bid in 2023, the Republic was at the crossroad. The people were becoming increasingly disillusioned by their government over impunity of grand corruption. Emotional scars of the decades of the bloody civil war remain deep. Unemployment was hard. Prices of basic goods and commodities were, strive, were, were skyrocketing. Sparked by the government failed economic policy, the move of hope and excitement that greeted the election of Mr. George Weir six years earlier has shifted at least half of the Liberian population was yearning for change. Then came the 79 years of 79 years old veteran politician who promised to rescue the country and its people. With five decades of working experience in the various governments, have served on a former president within our October as head of Liberia Produce Marketing Corporation. President Samuel Kamado Kama as Agriculture Minister, MOC Sawyer as head of Corporation of National Refinery and President uh, and Honor President Erin Johnny Salif as Vice President of the Republic of Liberia. Why can in touch the electorates with promise to face the country? Among this campaign <laughs> and early presidential promises. Three stand out, inclusive government, fighting corruption through accountability and transparency, and establishing a wide economic crimes code. Henceforth, President Buaga, who has been entrusted to supervise the affairs of the national state, is now uplifting distress and delusions in the society at this early stage. Rational Tennessee, Abbas. Rational Tennessee, Abbas. Gentlemen, agreement. Abbas. Gentlemen, agreement. Abbas. Just within six months of this presidency, an experienced man who has worked in government for five decades, plus demonstrating all these inconsistencies, which will mean a lot to the liberal masses. An asset, but being paid for not executing the responsibility for self office to insult the Liberian people. The asset recovery team abandoned all these big horses that were built by former, by former deputy minister for fiscal affairs, Samora Wolokori, the then president George Weir, and other key officials of the Weir led government to arrest Keke as a mean of requiring asset is, it, is an insult to the president. This is very seamless and reckless on the part of the asset recovery, of asset recovery team. They should claim the attention of the president in order, to, in order for him to add now to either this bond as a recovery team for not working in the interest of the Gabrian people or take form of slumber and, pro and be proactive. Manda! Well, well, well. Furthermore, the United Party government headed by Joseph Yuma Boyka has intentionally refused to lead with transparency and accountability. They have grossly refused to make elements of past regime to account for the form and manner in which the nation state was ran. Mr. Boyka recent communication to the House of Legislature on the recent F moving machines they negotiated and brought to the country is part of an effort to promote development across the landscape and is mischievous and also marked. Manda, where do? Lonely, 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 the fact that we're going to party. Lonely, lonely, yo, 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 y
and accountable to the Liberian people proceeding with lies, deceit, and irresponsibility. Just within six months, how come Mr. Boyka, who was considered a man of accountability, is now telling us about government agree gentleman agreement? This is a sign of betrayal and the continuation of business as usual. Reaction never tell us. Reaction never tell us. Business as usual. Business as usual. Business as usual. If Mr. Boyka doesn't live to his promises, the people will have no option but to rise against him. With experience and vigorous in the cause of massacre, in defense of students' rights, social justice, academic freedom and peace, so is calling on the, the impossible corner. Reactionary intelligence! Reactionary intelligence! Reckless pony! Arrogant pony! No, 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 to relinquish the office of student affairs within 48 hours to ensure the radiating and cordial relationship that existed between the office of student affairs and the student body one more be regained. That the office of student affairs that is used as a weapon of oppression and suppression toward the student leadership that is in the best capacity of championing the challenges students undergo daily on the campuses of the University of Liberia. Be free from intimidation. Dean Prof. Segu Kone, who has spent 30 years Working with the University of Liberia as a professor and administrator. Is a leader. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 power to me, viva. Viva, 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 that sits in the university, misappropriate his function and has gone student activity fees. But Conan, who is the head of Office of Student Affairs, doesn't want to embezzle student activity funds. Reactionary Tennessee. Reactionary Tennessee. But also, timid student leaders who try to express their views on the question of injustice. And issues the matter by illegal, illegally blocking their student IDs. If, if this does not appear as bar barbaric proceeding or elevation of the leadership, then what one will do is to move into action. An autocracy is exemplified, no freedom of expression through our human society. The last time we did our survey by using the TPA, which deals with logical indication and fact check, we were smartly informed and exposed to a greed and memorandum of understanding that in the procedure the fraudulent act of militants. Working of Prosecu Kone, who has always been in force with student leaders, a student money that which he claimed as 25% pot, is that light. We seek to call on the Prosecu Kone to relinquish the office of student affairs. If he refuses to leave, there will be continuous resistance of rebellion on campuses, on the campuses of the University of Liberia. The Bank of Student Education Party so. welcomes Dr. R. Hassan Conte to the University of Liberia as interim president, who has once again been trusted to serve as um, his alma mater in a strategic form to ensure tranquility is restored in the campuses of the University of Liberia. This preferment from the Board of Trustees speaks a lot. 
It may have a significant impact in short term on a university smooth transition. We students and militants of the Bangla Student Education Party so, who have been engaging past president of the University of Liberia on principles and policies that don't bloom the growth and development of the university. See this preferment from the president of the republic. This that that was done in accordance with the board of trustees as a milestone of progress as the university in, in transition period. So believe that the Asan Kontia, who is an international diplomat and academic scholar, who served the University of Liberia as its 12th president from 2004 to 2008, developed and made the university then to expand in the field of academia. During time, he co-founded co the Association of Liberia University, where he served as vice president for academic programs, has the capacity to steer the affairs and transition the policies that will help stabilize the university from its leadership. Comrades and friends, progressive journalists, we want to say to you that long live the fighting spirit of the courageous Vanguard Student Education Party, so don't live the fighting spirit of the militants, don't live the massacre, don't live the ever potent. Bang at the Kingdom Party. So, done an issue on this 15th day of July, AD 2024, by and through the mandate of the 32nd Police Bureau and Central Committee, concomitantly of the Vanguard Student Education Party. So, sign Comrade ASG Kelvin Obo George of the Vanguard Student Education Party. So, approve Comrade Chairman Kevin Abloa Batua, Chairman of the Vanguard Student Education Party. So, just few, 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 few questions quickly. Yeah. Few questions quickly uh, before you leave. So, so, this guy's, uh, so that there's a continuous try to uh, solicit views from uh, students who have come to write their exams. But how you doing, bro? Uh, welcome to Spoon TV. You just listened to um, the head of the student education party reading the statement. Uh, I know you're one of the students here. Okay. Let's let, let's let's talk to this gentleman. How you doing? Welcome to Spoon. We just listened to the reading by a uh, soup uh, yeah, meditants. What do you make of the the, the, the statements? Yeah, the statements are, are very. I think it, it makes a logic because they, you, you see logic in it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I yeah, think yeah, because I I, 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 will, I will say to everyone, the, one of the reasons that we're for of in charge of your government is what happening. So we can build government on friendship. Whenever someone is in, in going error, and these people try to tell you that this person is going error, you gotta, you gotta see the interest of the people. Remove the person, you can keep keeping that person to that particular place, and the people, uh, the citizens are complaining, telling you that this person is not fit for the position, the person is not working in line with the people. They keep evading government friendship. I don't see. You talk about, you, you talk about the president banning his administration on friendship, and is allegedly hating the University of Liberia. Yeah, yeah. Who particularly are you talking about? Yeah, oh, I think the, the, late the vice, pre yeah, vice the late president for student affairs. Yeah, the late embassies on 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 Amara. Mm. Yes. Seku Kone. Seku Kone. I mean, the late the late uh, embassies on Seku Kone. And you see uh, the, the link the link that they are giving. It, it just start uh, in, in, in a common sense. They try to tell you that. It, 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 yeah, yeah, Seku Kone. But Seku Kone, you know, uh, has been here for a long period of time uh, as length. So, uh, why would you say the president is 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 appointing this? No, uh, yeah, yeah, we can be here for a long period of time. It's just we, we know and then we agree with that. We can go with that. But Seven Kone is not the one who is spearheading in the, the university. Okay. The university wrong, but we are wrong by by team. The guys, everyone got a leaders, everyone got heads. So whenever the heads, the students, the citizens are complaining that they don't, they don't need the president, they don't need the team, but we change the president. Okay. I think that would not be necessary because, as you can see now, everyone here we are scattered this morning. Every and people got up, and people are taking their phone and then people fighting here and there. That right. Does not make sense. Thank you so much. You so let, let's speak to this lady as well. Okay. Uh, okay. So uh, we want to talk to at least uh, the, the general balance this. All right. We want to general balance this discussion to hear from more students as it relates to. Uh, but while we try to uh, general uh, uh, general balance this stuff, let us do this. This this one. How are you? Yes. Uh, you just listen to your colleagues. I would say colleagues because you guys are all students here. Reading really the statement against the um, 
you guys taking the exam. What do you make of it? Well, you have to call your name, perhaps you tell the public why you're waiting here, and then you, you begin. Once again, I'm about to be camera. Oh, I spoke to you earlier. Oh, okay, yes, go ahead. <laughs> okay, go ahead, go ahead. Yes, let that do a shot. Someone asked what you said. Well, for now, the way I'm staying, I'm living in the world. All this thing is required time. I don't know, we live out of your buses in Kia, we got all the people where they are found out. So unfortunately, they see me there, already they just love the whole stuff. So, so you are regretting the time in, in summary? Okay. No, okay. So but therefore, you, 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 you ask the administrator to do something very speedily? Very slow, but why? The problem about UL, the course is very easy, but the OP is the time. Okay. It's you. And you see almost the semester is only for six to seven months instead of four months. Semesters? Six to seven months? Just for a semester? Wow. So it's a delay to us. Okay. Thank you so much. But you're not at us? Yes. So, yes, that's right, gentlemen. Uh, welcome to Spoon. This is the best actually to play. Uh, tell us your, uh, how you feel about this incident this morning. Yeah, thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, so let's continue. You mean the action affecting thousands of students here at the State Run University? What's our regret about the action? What's our regret about the action? Your regret about the action? What's our regret about the action? all right thank you so much thank you so much oh, what's the level here what's the level here oh freshman student okay thank you so much so let's talk to uh this uh it's one of the student leaders here all right so welcome to spoon yeah, yeah we introduce yourself we're talking and then we had to uh listen to uh, uh those many things yeah yeah thank you and so uh, I'm William Busan Regina, student representative for the New York Council in the Royal Academy of Interim Leadership. Mm. Oh. Yeah, so uh, you did ask the question about violence on coding, and I told you that it was unfortunate, and I came across the situation at hand. Uh, we are being to know about the issues surrounding today's action. So I people inform you that the centers around Puroga party differences. So within the university. Within the university of Liberia. Okay. So when you say, so, when you say it's centered around political party differences within the university, what are you trying, clearly trying to see? Yeah, so that has that has to do with uh, politics. So, uh, yeah, so that, uh, uh, what's the take about this entire, you know, happening you know, today? When we started the struggle, say we call it thought that we were bluffing. Your name, please. 
My name is Ishaka Jekuma, the membership chair of the Father's Day Unification Party. We are going to ensure that Senator leaves the University of Abroad because he's very corrupt. He's a thief, he's a role, he must leave the university. He's staff for the SL University. Senator Kwane has engineered a lot of corruption activity on this campus. So there's no need, there's no impact on Senator Kwane on the campus. He has been here for over 20 years. 20 years of service to the University of Abroad and there's no changes. Senator Kwane needs to leave the university or else there will be no further work for the resistance of the protest on this campus. We are very clear, we are adamant, we are resolute, and we will not be deterred by anybody. With all the allegations you leverage it against him, yeah. do you have evidence for yeah, that? Yeah, evidence is the next president of the bank. When, 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 when you say he's criminal, what can you prove? From what perspective are you talking about? The favorite entrances that have been examined on, uh, have been, you know, carrying on this campus. The university, the leaders of the university, say we cannot, cannot be extricated from that clique. That clique. It's part of them, they are, they are, they are, they are, they are pocketing those fees of the entrances for their own personal aggrandizement. There's no change. Look at the university of Abroad. The so whenever very deplorable, when, students are sitting in CPSB building the rings, falling, real falling. You tell about this, this the, you talk about the university being deplorable. Uh, yes. The current status of the university uh, for the past months is yeah. better than, you know, how it was. You know, we all know that uh, of recent, the university was renovated. renovated I saw sense. it. Yes, I, 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 I saw the painting of, of, of the Vera buildings. I they, saw the picture of the Vera buildings. I saw, I saw, I saw, let me, let me, I saw, I saw, I saw, some of the buildings. There's no impact. There's no impact of the so-called renovation. That's not, it was a fail. Some, some may say you discuss it with settlement. All right. So. So I uh, was trying to, you know, but let's get back, you know, uh, when we do interview, they will have to, you know, they, they will come and, you know, uh, ask us not to interview students that are, you know, regretting their action. So, yes, bro, you are talking, it, 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 it seems like, I don't, I don't, I don't, want to, I don't want to say, you know, I mean, unlucky, but anytime no, we no, interview, they, they, they will come to, you know, they, they you know. They, they know me and, and we played our part before years back. We represented the Avangar Progressive Student Alliance at the University of Labrua Posa as chairperson. And today we have ascended to the leadership of the University of Labrua as regards to student representation. So you are part of the, the, the university student leadership in terms of students? Yeah. Okay. So by then we participated in the in the in the political SAP that has to do with the political party like they are doing now. So 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 we we, we we, 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 we passed through that strength, and but ours were not on the basis as but what is unfolding now. So now, it, 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 so no, now it, it is good. It's I come in. It is good that you part of the the, the the student leadership at the state run university, right? They are alleging that uh, you know uh, the vast the vast president for student affairs, Mr. Sekupone, is criminal, and he's this, he's that, you know, and and they don't want him leave the university. So as a student representative. To the year council and i told you that i participated in the active agitation of political parties on this campus representing the afghan african student alliance posa and we know the guys they from the student education party but what is unfolding previously i told you that it has to do with political party disenchantment or differences so over the period of time about six to eight months now the student education party has been experiencing some fraction in the party that has to do with chairmanship. We, as POSA, it's, it's normal, you know, it, it normally happens in the political setting where there will be struggle for power. But your struggle for power within the political party should not, should not supersede the interest of the student in terms of the academic activities of soldiers. So the the struggle for power within your political party should be handled within, inwardly, and not to come on the campus of the University of Gabriel, particularly the U.S. campus and disrupt classes. We didn't do that. If your issues are student based, it has to do with internet or some kind of, you know, buses, those were things that we agitated on behalf of students in, in regards to our party. Yeah, but today, what is unfolding, what you have just witnessed, it's on auto door because, as per my understanding, this particular man in question is not a legitimate chairman of, of soup. The reason why they got issue with 
with, with, with Dinkone, quote unquote, they said that Dinkone was able to recognize the authority that has to do with Kevin. One, one point, point. And so with that, they believe that the corner has been fringed on their right. So they are calling for the removal of the corner. It's not, it's not ideological, it's not student based, it's not student sentimental, it's about their personal interest. And today, the students are victimized and by their quote unquote egotistic behavior of leadership. But we want to say, as student representative, and that's why I wrote in the leadership chapter where the corner is. Because there has been a normal routine. We don't want to preach the politics. I'm a student representative, but there has been a normal routine that this kind of authority has gone on on this campus and student affairs have not taken any drastic action. Whether we did it in the past, whether others did it, they have not taken drastic action. And I don't want to be so much coming down hard on the Studentification Party because they have perpetrated violence on this campus numerous times and student affairs have not taken action. Today, their own making is standing against them, is biting them, and all we can say is that we are here to protect the interests of the students. Team Kone and that of the new dealership must step in and take action. Just take action. What action do Just will you action. recommend? The action they have within the purview that has to do with student governance. They have student handbook. The party that you form, Palok, is on record signed with state political actors disrupting academic activity here. When he came to realize that it was it is bad to so, disrupt academic so, activity here, so, when you spend here and some of this action here, so with your allegation, I consider it as an allegation. And I, and it's not allegation because we we, 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 we are and some of the journalists who who, who have our, better or call your program. Our protestation, and I make it clear, all of our protestation on this campus has been in the interest of the students. The students issue, are accused issue, your party issue, here of stolen. We are not in debate, you are interviewing me, right? I said you want to I'm, show I'm you want to show I'm trying to remind as, you of some of the activity here and before. that's what I'm telling you. On our watch, on our watch, on our party, because it's my alliance, all our protestation has been in the interest of the student. One, let me name to you the issue that has to do with free tuition on this campus. It was the avant-garde party. So you you care to lay an instinct as well as being demonstrated here today, that's why I say I'm a student representative, I represent supers, I represent posa. I don't want to be too political. That days of being political under the chairmanship of the avant-garde party is gone. So I don't want to come down high on the student education party because they have their members. But we want to say, as per the record, the student education party has been the one that has orchestrated violence on this campus. They have brutalized students, all in our students, we have footage to that. And student affairs have never taken a drastic action. I challenge you to show any evidence of uh, So, sir, you, you, uh, you, 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 you are now of part of this, the, the, the student so leadership. So, we want to say, as what I will said, you recommend to the The recommendation is that student affairs must look within the handbook. That any student who can make the act of an order their own outside of academic authority, they are penalties, they have to do with suspension, they have to do with expulsion. And so, over the years, they have not practiced that. Let, okay, let's agree that the African party did it. So as student representative, what has student affairs done to them? Are they suspended on a student? So what we are witnessing is false on student Until affairs. Until you tell us. So I'm telling you that student affairs, over the years, about almost decades, they have not taken any action against this kind of activity. Today's students should be taking the test. So it tells you that the student affairs is an app in terms of governing the affairs. Of, 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 of the students here to protect the rights of students. And we as student leaders are here to protect the rights of students in terms of the academic student. We may, we may be active in politics, but our understanding from the Avanga party that your involvement into advocacy should not be a hindrance because you are advocating for students. So how can students be taking the final in your mind and come and disrupt them? What does that mean? Are you advocating? They assume that you have parted with, with you have issues. Okay, party. so, so uh, have uh, if we conclude, we'll have to, you know, uh, it, it, have this it, interview it, with general balance. Central about to... to drop in the student classes. You know the current office. You know the current personality. You got, you got a board of trustees. You can write a letter and take it on to the corner, but you, not to develop the student you can, can, we, can we have other students and the female students to speak to us as well? This is the method continuously over the part that you and have And that's why I'm telling you that student affairs I'm saying as student representative, if the students should want anyone liable of these actions, student affairs should be responsible. Please conclude quickly. And we are calling upon student affairs. Conclude quickly, we have to talk to one or two students. Because there will be a time that the students will take their own, their own authority into their own hand and will be targeted. You see 15 men, 15 men in your mind, if these students want to resist those guys, 
You know what will happen here? Your congress said, sir. So we are saying if students affairs cannot take charge of the matter and settle a, the students themselves will protect themselves. You know what it means when we're taking time is showing grab bottle? So so instead of instead of So whether the student education party has a, a fragment in leadership and student affairs is charged to settle that and up to now it has not settled and the students are victimized, we are calling upon the new leadership honor that as a content to ensure that student affairs get in and settle this matter thank in the sooner possible time. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. Thank you. We look forward so to folks, that I'm one of the Sando Junior Student Representative of your thank council. Thank you. So we can have to maybe talk to one or two students here to express their views uh, concerning this matter. And then we will come to an end. We actually want to talk to uh, the females. Where are the females? Can we talk to one of the females right there? Let's talk to the females. Right Let them tell us uh, what they make of that. You know, uh, welcome. Uh, uh, work on, work on, work on the spoon, you know. The females are, you know, um, getting shy. But let's try to talk to this lady. Uh, how you doing? Welcome. Little Spoon TV. Okay, it's on the other side. You just, um, uh, maybe you can just introduce yourself. Uh, I know you came for exam this morning. Of course, you declare you are out. Tell the public how you feel about this action. I'm well, this morning we came for our test. We are for our fighting for soup. So we are very, very much sad about the idea. Some of us were prepared to take our test, and we are prepared to take test this week and go to our little hustle for the following week of the semester to be open again. But it is so sad that the rain beyond us grab bottles. You know, we are ladies, things got messy for some of us. It is not easy. It is not easy for we, the few males, to leave our activities and come to school. Just imagine, and then we are not learning anything. Every day is a protest in the UL campus. So we want a government to not be So, uh, what are you regretting so far? Besides, you know, being thrown out of the class today, what's your regrets? I'm regretting. By leaving my home, leaving my child, by coming more in the name of family to take tests at the end of the day, you never complete that test. That's my point. So, you try to make recommendation to the administration and even the government. What are those specific recommendations that you will make? If there has to be action, what action are you recommending to the administration to be taking yeah, against these guys? Based on the action, we we'll let the administration to take action on it. Parties are always doing those things back. Probably calling them and talking to them. They are not advocating for us. Because if they are advocating for us, they should allow us to take our tears and then they can go on with what they want to do. When they can allow us, so they say that they are advocating for us, destroying our tears is not advocating. They want to destroy us. They are not advocating for us. Is, is there any, any way maybe regretting why you should enter the University of Liberia instead of any other school? Well, I'm regretting, but I have no means. There's the only university that I can afford to come. So I will regret, but I have to be patient because I don't have money to go other practice university to extend my education. Right. Okay. Thank you so much. You said your name again, and what are you reading? I'm Ben Wilson, reading public administration, major sociology manual. Thank you so much. Okay, so that's Benun uh, expressing her uh, own views concerning about this uh, this action. But folks, that's it. I want to Yes, so uh, you could be the last person. Thank yes. you. You do yourself, please. I'm Emmanuel M. Guzman. Okay. Student at the University of Liberia, reading public administration major. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Tell us your, your, your yeah. opinion about this action. Uh, this honestly, day. what happened here today, mm. I believe that the administration has played a political issue in our education. Okay. And our students as well, we should be you know, in a better position of placing themselves together for a better society. They are, are agreeing with the administration today and they are disrupting activity of our, the state-run university. I'm only calling on them. The students, the people, students, and somebody play, they are now of that the content. They are reserved for what threatening the students' life. Then our education, our, our academic activity smoothly go on rather than, you know, disrupting our activity. Because what happening today, 
on the campus of the University of Liberia is of quite unfortunate issues. You cannot be protesting for a genuine cause for threatening the peaceful citizens of our, the, the university life. At what time? The, peace, the peaceful students. Peaceful students. I believe that what is happening sooner is that Sue have gone apart. We listened to a portion of the university's uh, uh, student unification party of recent. They said that students were going to what go about it taking an exam or taking a final. Why come at this stage? In fact, disrupting activity. If people are using administration and using you people because they are giving your down to disrupt academic uh, academic activity, they will not help. So, no, when you said. Uh, giving down. What do you mean? Will you like giving them money? Who, who giving the, who giving the students money? I really understand that the administration, some portion of the administration, has you know involved with those with those issues about students continue to what and rob or how they disrupt activity of on this campus. That, that, that take time. That take time, right? On this particular you know uh, issue, right? When you said the administration giving you know money to students to get on these actions, will you love to be specific? Perhaps who is that administrator? Uh, maybe yeah. That, that tells us clearly Those what you mean. Involved. The issue is very simple. You know, mm. what may I have said is that if you look at this, the activity of the student unification party now, they have become splendid. In fact, what they do normally is that they will go to other portions. Then now they still have two party uh, party chairmen. Who can the student listen to? You brought up a lot of genuine advocacy for the, advocating for the student life of, our, of the university. But as Spender yourself, in fact, you, other people will be backing the man who is claiming today to be corrupt man, the other portion. This is the, the backdrop we are saying that clearly that the, the administrators are involved with the issue of our splitting the student group, in fact, disrupting academic, academic activities on this campus. So we are calling on them to install, to install, how do you stop those things because. So, in short, are you alleging that? Uh, some administrators in the university library will be will, will pay some of the students that you do this in my interest and the other people do say, do this. I mean, that's what I want to get. That, that, exactly. The activity of the student what is free for to do that there have been people, administrators who have been splitting them, you know, into, into uh, a path for them to uh, go about it, disrupting academic activity. Okay. Because nothing they are doing that will be beneficial to the student body. One group will not be saying without go back to class and other people. What we are here for is to learn. What waste our time? What waste the student time? In fact, you are protesting for a, a man to resign as the administrator. What bring about what threatening of the, what the student life? If you are concerned yourself to be a student, you should be placed in a position that to advocate for what the entire student body of the state run university. But you will see few group of people coming in the, in the, in the form of a suit. That should not be. We believe that what suit was funded for is not what we are seeing today. So we regret the action and we believe that the administration will come up with what a full day for our, our final test and let it be known to all students that we have a you know, revised or what the test schedule for, for, the, for the semester. We want to complete this semester. We believe by September graduation should be taking place at the University of Liberia. We want to work, complete our semester successfully. Now we're in people want to work, give certain you know, level of political you know, equipment at the detriment of the world, the student community. So I want to say thank you for giving me the time. Yeah, well. Thank I'm you. Emmanuel M. Right, thank thank you. Thank you so much. So folks, that's it. Uh, it's enough now. You have listened to the students. You have students who, who were taking the exams and they were forcefully uh, removed from classes by their colleagues from the student unification party. Um, they have stated the reasons. We listen to the both sides. That is from the student militants and also, uh, should I say, civilian students. <laughs> but it's actually interesting here, folks. Thanks so very kindly for watching. This is Spoon and I'm Sylvester. Chill play. Thank you.